They said, I was listening to your voice over the radio and when everybody else's voice was in total panic, you sounded like you were calm. What do you have that I don't have? And guys started asking me questions about Jesus the very next day. I didn't even get all the way off those Humvees until they were grabbing me, wrapping their arms around me and saying, I gotta talk to you right now about Jesus, Jeff, because you have something that I don't have. And whatever that is, I want that. So how can, how can I have your faith? And I started sitting down and I started talking to my ranger buddies about Jesus. And many of them came to the moment of realizing if I get on a helicopter, if I get on a Humvee, if I don't make it out of these city streets alive, I don't know where I'm gonna spend eternity. Jeff, I need to nail this one down and I need to do it right now. And I start to feel the Holy Spirit of the living God poking me in the chest and he's starting to tell me a powerful moment that I don't think I'll ever forget. There's one of those moments where I felt the Holy Spirit convict me that Jeff, what you've been living for as an army ranger is not worth dying for. And I want you to start to live for something that's worth dying for. And everything else is easy after that.